What's up, y'all? It's Crispy here, and welcome to Six Warrior Quest Area 2. Now, I will be only using my very first party. I will not be touching my second party, hopefully. That's the plan. Let's see how it goes. This is my very first run of this. I will be absolutely rushing the Dullahan. I do not want it to be alive at all. It's the main source of all of our problems. We do not vibe with the Dullahan, okay? We are going to just build up and just absolutely nuke. I can't hear my phone at all. It's so weird when I'm recording. There you go. I hear it a little bit now. All right. Now let's just get going here. We'll hit B just a little bit. And now we're just going to FR charge with Charlotta. Let's get it. Don't care if we're not getting any brave. Doesn't matter. We're just here to charge, baby. And we have Rydia Call, so we will have three turns of Blink. That will help us significantly, I promise you. Now, I'm pretty sure I can Rydia Charge. Or not Rydia Charge, Charlotta Charge. But if not, I can always swap in... What's her face? Uh, Luna Freya, just in case. But I'm pretty sure we're just going to use this. We're going to need it. Titus can get us pretty far. I don't want to use all of them just yet. I'll use... I'll do one more rotation and then I think we should be good. Yeah. I do want to get a little bit of damage off on Dillahan so that we can nuke it during the BT phase. I want to get it to at least 80 something. So I did do a little more than I thought. All right, let's get this up and let's get our shenanigans going. I wish I had Seymour call, but alas, I need the Kurasame for Kane. We all know that. Now this would have been perfect if Kane went first, so he would have been hitting hella damage with all that. You know what I mean? All right, let's get this break right here. Let's just hit this, you know, get some HP damage up, some weakness. Bada bing, bada boom. Now we will hit the BT. And his next turn, we will use the other Kurosame call to get weakness on everyone and the Imperil. And we will just start going in, baby. I promise y'all, it's about to be crazy. Look at this, already at a hundo. And we got a lot to go, baby. We got a lot to go. I definitely want to get a jack shot out there, or like a three, like a break, so I can ensure that I get turn rate. Okay. Let's see, let's hit this. He's doing pretty good damage. You know, as per usual, it is Titus after all. We'll probably hit an LD right here because we're not even going to need to use all of his skills if I'm prepping correctly. All right, we're getting close. We're getting close to where I want to be. There you go. Perfect. That's what we wanted. Hit one more for the one time. You know how it is. Can't waste that free skill. Okay, now I might use Blitz Ace right now. Yes, that's exactly what I would do, actually. This is where we're going to start our setup. I've never set up this early before, so I'm, uh... I'm trying to think a couple moves ahead while I'm planning in the moment, you know what I mean? Alright, we'll hit this to get everyone hitting weakness damage. And goodbye, Kane. 
Love you, baby. Peace out, brother. All right, we are going to need to hit this. I almost messed up right there. I pressed the wrong button. Perfect. You'll love to see it. And might as well hit this bad boy. That's fine. Hit. Let me think. Okay, we use that. So we will do this one time. Oh, Kane doesn't have blink. Okay, Kane, you cannot come back down. I just, I just thought about that. We'll activate this. That's fine though. It's fine. Kane. We're gonna nuke this before Kane even comes back down, so it's all good. Excuse me. Just had to. I'm a little stuffy. I'm still a little sick. Look at that miss. Fantastic. Absolutely gorgeous. All right, now, let's see. Let me think. This will be one. Okay, this is exactly what we're gonna do. We're gonna do nine. This will leave nine turns. And we're gonna get extra HP up with this because I don't think you, you cannot launch the Dillahan, so do not use a Sid Rain's Call. I need to go into the burst phase immediately. I think he counters, so I'm actually going to hit this. Yeah, we don't want him to counter. So we have a couple more. Okay, there you go. We'll hit this. And then we will go into the BT phase. Pretty sure I'm doing this correctly. Nope, I could have hit that one. It's fine. It is what it is. We have one stack of that blink left, so A needs to absolutely go bye bye in this BT phase. Boom, here we go. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's get it, y'all. B is basic, or A is basically the delay hand. This chariot over here is basically the biggest threat. The zombie whale, he's just there to be annoying. But other than that, nothing. Now I'm pretty sure I'm going to go for DPS in this. So, uh, instead of doing one more quick hit, I'm going to use the EX instead. Because the EX will actually deal more damage. Like, probably double. And we need that right now. Even though we're absolutely nuking. So let me see. A skill one, then an EX, then an FR. Okay. Skill one. I'm trying to build the gauge as high as I can before I use that EX. And Kane is hitting for great damage, by the way. EX. Let's see how much this does. Oh, so many HP dumps. So much better than the, uh, the skill one would have been. Oh, this is just gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. It doesn't matter if you kill one um, before the other. I advise absolutely nuking the Jolly Hand to avoid all of the BS that it has in store. You see, all of its mechanics, I'm avoiding. Um, it's not getting to do anything that it wants. It's not freezing me, it's not doing anything. And the radio call definitely helps with that. Honestly, I might not even need to use the... Oh my god. 
I don't even need to. I, I can use Blitz Ace on B. That is how my. Oh my god. I did not know that was going to happen. I thought I was going to. Oh, yes! Woo! This is all working out. I love it when a plan comes to fruition because Ultimisia Griever did not go well. Look at that. Wow. Gorgeous. Only needed three characters. What about the HP requirements are? 35k, we should be good. Nah, you alright, bro. I do need to heal though, so... You should stop and be in that, uh, that HP happy stance, you know, that, that sap stance, yeah. We're not really vibing with that. So I hope y'all enjoyed this setup. I literally used Sherlotta as an FR uh, bot to build it. Then I used her as battery when we were actually able to get battery because in this stage, you're not always allowed to get battery at certain thresholds. I think it's like 79 to like 49 or something you are able. So it's you just gotta figure out those thresholds and you'll be good. Okay, so I'm actually not going to- Oh, I pressed the wrong button, son of a bitch. I meant to press the LD. Because I just lost my stacks. I didn't want Kane to come down. Because I can cheese. You see, I'm at 28, 48, or whatever. Dang, that is very unfortunate. Did not want that. Oh well, Kane's gonna have to come in. Hopefully we uh we don't fail the HP requirement. Because that would kind of suck. I think once you get to 19%, he switches stances. Yep, there you go. Stances are switched, we are able to recover HP. Gravy, baby, gravy. Let's just do this. Hit some damage. We're going to get Kane in the sky as soon as possible, as per usual. And we need Titus to, to heal. That's a definite. Let's just chuck this. I don't want you to get turn rate or anything like that. Titus is going to use LD 100% so I can maximize DPS. Hopefully we can finish the whale zombie off. Might not be able to, because it does have a decent amount of HP. I want to do it before they are able to use their FR, because that will cause some problems. That I do not want to do. Let me see, do I have anything else I can use? Okay. We are dealing really good DPS, though. Like, I will definitely... Oh, man, I'm gonna have to use this once and then EX. Because the EX is gonna deal more damage. I don't think we're gonna be able to hit it, though. Well, we might, we might. I think I'm using EX. I think we'll be, we'll be good. I think this will be the final. Yep, this is it. Come on. Don't fail me now. Come on. Come on, Titus and Kane. I love y'all. Come on. No, come on. No, he's going to be at 1%, isn't he? Oh, shoot. Oh, you bastard. Oh, that's fine. We're good. No HP attack. I was rushing for no reason. And that's the fight. If you want to Titus cheese it, you can 100% use Titus. Just as I did. You can use three characters to beat this. The only reason I had six people there was because it made me put six people in in order to start the quest. <laughs> so I hope y'all enjoyed. I hope this 
kind of showed y'all if you have these characters, you can cheese it without even knowing the mechanics because the mechanics for the Dullahan are annoying as hell. It will make it way more annoying. See, I had these there just for insurance purposes and I didn't even use them. But I hope you enjoyed. Please like, comment, and share. It really, really, really helps me and the channel out. Catch y'all next time. Peace.